How you guys doing again? It's your Stan Bates from T-Shirt Styles. We bring you guys another pep talk, and today's pep talk is about consistency. All right, consistency is very, very important when it comes to this industry. I'm gonna give you about two to three scenarios on why it's important. First and foremost, when I came up with my clothing line first, I was consistently putting out shirts. All right, throughout that summer, I only put out maybe five different shirts, which was a white one with black print, a white one with uh, red print a black one with red print, and a blue one with white print. And I put out hats. So I put out five things with it. All right, so what ended up happening is I was consistently pumping them out. So I wouldn't print large print quantities. I would print small ones. One, because I did my own manufacturing. I did my own printing. I just had to order the shirts in. All right, two, because I didn't know. I was unsure, okay? But being as though I was consistently putting them out, I had a great summer that summer. I probably reprinted, like the first time I may have printed two of every shirt, uh, every size. And then the next time I was printing five, next time I was printing six. But I probably printed at least a good seven or eight times that summer. All right, now, I was consistent throughout that summer, but after that I stopped. All right, and what that does, it hurt me because now that I'm ready to kind of take this serious, I have to rebuild awareness. Like I have to re, basically I'm almost starting from scratch. I'm not starting from scratch because I have uh, some set loyal followers that uh, that will purchase from me and everything like that. But, you know, and then when I tried to relaunch, I didn't, my plan didn't really pan out because of the timing and miscommunication. So if you're consistent, you won't have those problems. You want to build, start small. So I want to get outside of my immediate family and friends. All right. Then I want to build a cult that I can constantly, consistently put stuff out to that'll buy so if i have you know a hundred people that i know when i put a t-shirt out um they'll buy it that's consistent money first and foremost that's always that's consistent uh st almost startup cash you know so as i drop a t-shirt that t-shirt ends up paying for itself because i know these people you know are i'm selling to these people at a price point where they buy let's say twenty dollars and it cost me four or five to produce if these 100 people buy it, I can actually have four, buy 400 shirts, and I'll be at a break-even point, in a sense, okay? All right, so what happens is, you know, being able to consistently produce for those people, and now you can consistently and constantly put out content, or you can constantly put out apparel, or you can constantly, you know, come up with things that, you know, people will buy, and you'll build awareness consistently, and then you won't have to restart. All right, now... When it comes to the print industry, I don't know if you know this, but by being consistent, you can gain a lot of customers, all right? A lot of people uh, complain about or they will come to me about, you know, hey, I was working with this person, they disappeared, or I can't get in contact with them. That's even bigger in graphic design, so, and graphic design important. So what I'll say about that is, if you're not the designer, you need to have three or four, because sometimes, you know, in a creative industry, people go through blocks, and they won't answer the phone or they go through blocks and they can't produce things some of them all right so you want to have three or four people on your on your uh you know your your rolodex and let me go back to some old terms you want to have three or four people in your rolodex where you can send it to so i'm at the point now where i work with uh it's one main company and i work with about four or five people that i think are great designers for different reasons and so I can actually take a sketch now because I, I don't consider myself a, art, a graphic artist. I, only thing I can't do myself is draw. So being able to be as though I do do my own artwork, for the most part, I do send stuff out. So to, for, the, for me, graphic design consistency for me comes in basically being able to sketch something out and send it to a number of different people so that if this person is not available, Okay, let me see what this person over here is doing. All right, it's always tough when you work with a small business or a, a, a sole entrepreneur being consistent in this industry. So that's just one of my suggestions. All right, now the last thing I want to talk about is being consistent for you in life will, will definitely help you. No matter, it doesn't even have to be related to, you know, t-shirts. It could be related to something else in life. For me right now, my consistency is bringing you guys content, different content, unique content, new content. Uh, I'm not really worried about the quality right now of the content, which I will, you know, do a little bit better with later, but it's important for me to keep giving out content now that I've started. 
all right and basically what that's going to do is that's going to help you know you guys first and foremost but with me like i i won't be get away from uh giving you guys content so now i'll always be at the top of mind you guys can always ask me questions i can always respond with video or i can always come up with a new topic and being as though these aren't playing consistency looks different for me so consistency just means you know i'm gonna put out a video a week but i'm now i'm to the point where i'm putting out three or four based off of whatever ideas pop into my head uh and trying to bring you guys value consistently for you or someone else may be hey i need to put out a video every wednesday or i need to sit down every sunday and produce content for something or i need to do this or do that all right so let's get out here and be consistent guys let's get out here and crush on your side hustle all right this has been stan banks for t-shirt side hustle happy printing